This video is going to demonstrate the correct way to install our smart dimmers. We're using the L22, our two gang dimmer in this video, but all the information is transferable to the rest of our dimmer range. The first and most important step is to make sure the mains power is turned off and check to make sure before commencing any work. Loosen the standard light switch from the wall, identifying cables before you remove the light switch. Take a photo if you need to for reference later. Carefully unscrew the terminals of the light switch. Remove the faceplate of the Lightwave dimmer carefully without scratching it. The colours of wires used in older houses can vary considerably, and if you are unsure then please consult a qualified electrician. Traditionally, red wire would be live and black neutral, and after 2006 these coloured changed to brown for live and blue for neutral. If you are presented with a two-way switching, then the old switch will have L1, L2 and common terminals. Lightwave dimmers simplify this to live in and switch live out. You may discover a complicated and jumbled set of wires behind a standard light switch. In this case, either check our support pages on our website, get in touch with our tech support team, or consult a Lightwave Pro who you can find through our installation map on the website. Then the dimmer can be fixed back onto the wall. One of my favourite design touches is the use of clear plastic surround. This makes finding the fixings a whole lot easier. Put the faceplate back on, again carefully not to scratch anything, and then the mains power can be turned back on which triggers the dimmer into auto calibration mode. Next is the Link Plus pairing process. Make sure that your Link Plus is connected to the router, powered on, and the light is solid green. Open the Lightwave app, click on the plus button, device, and enter device name. Place the dimmer into linking mode by pressing one pair of buttons simultaneously. When the LED flashes alternately red and blue, press the link button on the app. The dimmer will flash rapidly light blue for a short period of time. The app will ask you which room you would like to put the device into. There is a default room set up, but we recommend setting up the rooms in your home to make it easier to manage devices in the future. Click done in the app and the pairing process is complete. The name of the device and the room you've placed it in are not fixed in stone. You can change them to move things around at any time. For more information, please consult the installation manual visit our website or ring our technical support team.